Hello everyone, I'm back with another video, and in today's video we're going to be up against Votbim Netak, Northwood, and Spytek. And I'm going to be with Universal Soldier and Ghost. Now of course, before we start, make sure to subscribe and uh, smash the like button, as well as ring the bell icon to be notified of any content coming out of my channel. Let's go. Alright, so I'm going to be the green player, which means I'm going to be at the bottom. Ghost being the red player. Universal Soldier as our navy guy. Okay, skip forward. Skip, skip. Skip the container collection. Okay, so, I mean, to be honest, this is not really a good start here for me. No. I actually tried to micro here, however... That fortress is coming here. Oh, wrong boost, Imboy. Ghost touch, Imboy. All right, and so there's just too many things here with with what I have to handle, regardless of how godly I micro. Oh, yeah, and the Cerberus almost one shotting that armadillo. I mean, definitely balanced. Super container being obtained by the blue player once again. So actually, the, that this blue guy will be filthy rich. Boom! Solid hit right there. Okay, see an engagement here. I mean, this is not really good. So my partner opted out to retreat, which is the best course of action. Since the, there's like two servers around here. But he did manage to take out plenty of the assault, damage the servers, as well as take out a typhoon and a hammer. Not really that bad. Now, Universal Soldier prompted us to defend this location as, of course, um, well, basically, they'll be attacking uh, them next. Now, I'll be building a gun tower here just to safeguard my base against that early aggression. And, of course, developing my base, Mole here, as well as a Jaguar and, of course, a Dragonfly and a Porcupine against that Seraphim Rush. Okay, we see a Delta poking around here. Scouting. Boom, and another Delta. You don't have to run away. Okay, and here goes Delta. A bunch of Delta. Along with the Assault. Three players here. CN, Purple, and Blue player is here against a Ghost. And uh, yeah, it's not really looking good here with the army composition that he has. Um, Wasp here from Universal Soldier. Solid hit on those uh, units. And I'm going to have to try and micro my Dragonfly outside the range of that uh, Typhoon. And then attack the uh, damage units by those with the affected units by the uh, acid burst. Okay, taking out a, a hammer and a delta, which is very, very nice. And we'll be zoned out by those typhoons yet again. A jaguar already popped out here. Okay, there's like a bunch of typhoons. Ooh, man, that, that barely lived. Okay, Cerberus face to face with my, with my uh, jaguar. Mole coming out in here. And again, they're still not done yet. They're still trying to demolish my partner, Ghost, here. And that Cerberus will die. Ooh, almost taking out... Oh, wow. It, it actually took out a... It actually took out that Jaguar. But whatever. Okay, Mole is here now and managed to destroy a Typhoon and dam severely damaging those Deltas. Now, while those Typhoons are on March mode, they actually managed to take out the Wasp. But... Yeah, I mean, after being acid striked by those, uh, by the wasp. Okay, here we go. Again, developing my base. HQ level 4 now. Let's see how Universal Soldier is doing. Naval platforms around there. Good naval platform positioning. And the Hawk Scout here from my end, as I already have Hawk on HQ level 3. There you go. HQ level 4 here, transitioning to X facility level 3 for Death Solaris. Seraphim is out, level 4 HQ. This guy also just transitioning to a Serafima, and there's not really that much here to see from this EM player since he actually used a lot of deltas early on. So that delayed his base development. Okay, hiding some infantry across the bushes here, or infantry in the bushes, so to gain any high ground view as well as scout. Okay, 
So it's been quiet so far here. Good spread of uh, Dragonfly Scout there from Ghost to see any uh, Seraphim whatever shenanigans. Also Scout right here by Universal Soldier again leaving this uh, small narrow uh, fog of war right there to be um, to be crossed by any Seraphim rush of shenanigans sneaky attack. Super container appearing right here. I'm going to have to use the Hawks here to dispose of that Delta. There you go. Very, very good. Okay, now. Now, I actually missed Micro here thanks to the lag. Again, um, Ghost trying to obtain this super container. However, there's like, wow, two players, a Seraphim, a Zeus. And it's not really looking good with what he has. Although, he did manage to grab one container out here. But that's going to be the, the best thing that he can do at this point. Okay, well, I'm not really going to care about the super container at the bottom side of the map since, uh, you know, I mean, I don't really have much, to be honest. Okay, I'm, I wanted to try and help out by the with the Hawks. However, those Typhoons actually repositioned themselves closer to the army. Instead, I used my ground army composition here along with ghost uh, army composition to somewhat zone out the rest. Shield? Oh, purple guy is here as well. Okay, Mole Turret has been used. Okay. Ooh. Okay, that's... Alright, well, that's absolutely wicked. T took out two Typhoons. However, the Solaris from the Purple player is here. Ooh, disgusting damage in a straight line. Okay, so I'm going to have to retreat. I'm going to have to switch to Gold Scouting Boost to speed up the units that I have in terms of retreating. So I'm full-on retreat. Leviathan just popped out. Mammoths are now in production. A chameleon and a jaguar. Okay, no, man. That's that's rough, dude. That is so rough. Here we go. So, we see the, uh, two armies around here. From the blue and the purple player. And also a Solaris from both sides. Oh, my good lord. Let's see how this is going to turn out. By the way, Universal Soldier making a very, very good concave around there. Going back to the action of the front lines. That chameleon from Universe. Oh, that go! Ooh, just missing it by a tiny cell. Okay, here we go. The Seraphim. Okay, using a uh, air raid boost. Okay, we got like two Leviathans here as well to combat the Seraphim, the Solaris. And we got like plenty of Typhoons around there. Oh my good lord. Let's see if we can push this back. Let's see how this turns out. Chameleon popped out here in my end. And so my confidence actually rose up. And there's like two Seraphims attacking the, that Leviathan. And two Solaris now. Oh shoot. Okay now. Moltres has been deployed. Covering it with the Chameleon. Moving my Chameleon around. Oh man. Almost destroyed the Jaguar and so on. The mole actually used the passive. Okay, here we go. Leviathan active skill. Let's go. Oh, that chameleon is so low on health. Boo! Here we go. The acid strike here, man. Shield has been taken out by the mammoths. Hawks are here. Three seraphims. Another nuclear dropping from Ghost. That seraphim will die. Okay. Really, really good. We see some torrents in action here as the torrents has just recently been buffed. Okay, now Leviathan from Universal Soldier as well. Let's see how this turns out. It's going to throw the nuclear. Kablooey! Alright, well, a huge chunk of damage. And again, Mammoths are simply raining rampage from afar. Meanwhile, I'm using a recovery boost and re producing a wasp here in non-stop unit production here in my end. Okay, now here we go. Okay, again, the mammoths are firing from afar. Free damage, dude. Free damage. Okay, again, using the recovery boost to recover the HP of my Leviathan. Oh man, that's a lot of torrents! Five torrents there, dude! Okay. Uh huh, a lot of typhoons here, as well as the Seraphim of Zeus pouring over all over the map here to push us back. 
Yay! Okay, sir, if he's out for the count. Let's see how this goes now. I got like plenty of mammoths now firing from afar. Okay, now those torrents. Oh, shoot, man. Ooh, let's see here. The hawks coming in to help out, dish out the damage on those uh, shield. Kablooey! Oh, it still lived! And here we go. Acid strike now and the nuclear. Okay. Boom! One nuclear out. Coming here on my end. Mole turrets. Boom! Erased. Okay, so I'm going to have to retreat again using recovery boost to recover the HP of my Leviathan that's been badly bruised up here. I don't have any chameleon. My chameleons just now are in, yeah, entering the fray here. Oh, <laughs> we're actually managing to push them back with the help of my mammoth spire from afar. Okay, here we go. I just double tap right here. And everything that can be seen by my mammoths will be rain. Oh, man. Ooh, shoot, man. Passive or active after active skill from all the heroes from both sides. Ooh, those zoos are so low on HP. Okay, mammoths again trying to fire at any units here. Primarily destroying those typhoons. And now they barely have any typhoons here. And now here again, I'm trying to go ahead and push forward here. Acid strikes have been dropped. Let's see, Molt turret under the cover of the Chameleon. Okay, Wasp will now retreat. Both the sea and the blue and the purple is here. Well, we also see an engagement right here from Universal Soldier. As of course, there will be an evident lack of Vikings. As of course, some of the CN player is here with the Zeus and the Cerberus that just laying down there. Hey man, <laughs> stop chilling. Okay, now, and we see here the number of those alligators from Universal Soldier is absolutely shredding those Vikings apart. Desperately, CM player trying to defend its the shore with an able platform. Going back to the front lines here. Oh, man, it's dishing a huge check of damage. I'm even using a recovery boost at this point. Oh, dude. <laughs> That's a bunch of mammoths right there in the back, safely demolishing those units. And here we go, acid strike. Ooh, good lord. Just now switching to an air raid. And now my hawks are going to rain rampage on those. Uh, on that Serafima. There goes the nuclear dropping. Oh, you're not gonna stand a chance now. Those uh, shield are now soft. Nuclear here on my end. Acid burst did not hit really anything. And then of course the nuclear hitting myself. And closely damaging that seraphim oh man just look at the mammoths here dude just firing from the back side of things okay and that solaris will fall all of a sudden the the favor has shifted in our end and just like that this guy will fall as the leviathan of universal soldier will absolutely wreak havoc on that guy's base along with the downfall of both the blue and the purple from our end Likewise guys, if you enjoyed this much content, make sure to subscribe, smash the like video, and of course ring the bell icon to be notified. Comment down below what are your thoughts into the mammoth changes, and likewise, thank you so much for watching, have yourself a great day and good luck with your battles. Bye.